What is going on? Welcome back to the Jewelry Box. It's your girl, Empress Gem. I'm here to drop those jewels. Aquarius, look, baby, before we even get started, you at the bottom of the deck. Okay. I started singing some old ass J-Lo. I think she was still Jennifer Lopez on the 6th. I'm feeling so good. I knew that I would. <laughs> Been taking care of myself like I should. Yes, but guys, what's going on? What's up? How it been? How it's going to be? What it do? How it's been? Right, right. Give the video a thumbs up, guys. Subscribe. Hit that notification bell button. Comment below. Share the love, okay? Share it. Share it. Share it. Share it. Spread it. Give it. <sighs> y'all is the last one of the series, and let me tell y'all. Y'all, and th this feels good. I feel like y'all been low-key. Y'all been doing the work. Y'all been healing. Doing, doing the damn thing, okay? Now you <laughs> Let me tell y'all, this is beautiful. My baby, oh my God, this is like beautiful. Like, I kid you not. And those orgitas, like, you done went apart from yourselves and you're the masculine, you're feminine. You let them and then you brought them back together and you're just like cold. You're one, you're beautiful right now. And this looks good as hell. Like, you understand your dark and your light side. Like, you're growing, you're elevating, okay? Like I said, this is beautiful as hell. So we're gonna see what we got for you guys for the month of March, all right? Divine Holy Spirit, let's get into this for... Aquarius, guys, general message, take what's for you, leave us behind. But like I said, we started with you and you having control over your life, Aries energy, and making a decision here. Which action to take? You've been making the right decisions, okay? Yes, you done made the right decisions, okay? You healed, you thought about it, you sparked that fire, you let that passion be ignited, and you went towards it, okay? And putting in the work, doing the work, that's the truth, okay? Uh, Swiss Army, okay? Like, you, you made a way. You made a way, okay? Through all of this, through all the darkness, you know... Whatever, like, you you navigate it, you followed your bliss, and you are here in a beautiful place. Yeah, this is helpful hands, okay? You learn to delegate, you know, you stop overworking yourself, a lot of you guys. So that you could take care of you, you can be better, yes, be in a joyful place here. Delegate a three of cups, started working with other people. Have people come in and supply that help, okay? You cook the meal tonight, you clean the bathroom, I ain't doing all this, I'm putting my feet up, I'm relaxing. I, <clears throat> yes, Aquarius. Yes, Aquarius. So, Divine Holy Spirit, what do we have here? We're going to pull one here, guys, from the next world. Tarot. Okay. Got some nosy folks around you. All up in your Kool-Aid. It's probably why that moon energy here as well. You're keeping stuff low-key. You learning. That you have, you must have had a lot of Debbie down as negative Nancy's around you, Angry Birds. Mm hmm. Yep, Six of Cups reunion. Getting back to yourself, getting back to your friends, getting back to loved ones, getting back to life, getting back to society, getting back to that inner peace and that happiness, finding your mojo, your gojo, being emotionally fulfilled. Some of you guys are grandparents. You're, you're, like I said, you're reconnecting with family, okay? Especially after COVID, you know, we was on another little lockdown, things is opening back up whatever, mass mandates dropping, all that good stuff, ladybugs could be a significance, but you're getting back to it, okay? I don't know, I heard a Karate Kid, only because that little boy got pink hair, it could be a girl, but that pink hair remind me of Jaden, and I instantly saw Karate Kid, so whatever. Could be dealing with a Scorpio here, right? Right, yeah, you cutting people out, making decisions, right? Exactly, exactly, protecting your energy, protecting yourself, Okay, like I said, I go back to that COVID thing. You know, you had to cut things out, shut things out, keep yourself safe, especially if I feel like I'm talking to an older Aquarius here, or maybe you just have people in your family or your household, you know, who um, are immunocompromised or, you know, are more susceptible to catching COVID and probably not doing so well with it, right? So, but yeah, you, you block people out your energy. You took time for you, got back to you, and now you're just going back out and you're enjoying your life. Some of you guys is getting ready to go by the beach. It must be getting warm by where you're at or going out to the park, enjoying. Yeah, and that's the truth right here. You know, you seek judgment when you went within yourself, realize what you were missing, what you needed, and you're getting back to the basics. Okay, yeah, you've been patient. Okay, you're getting balanced. This is Sagittarius energy here. The truth, that is judgment, that is karma, that's Capricorn, Scorpio type energy, Libra energy. Yeah, following your gut, following your mojo. Okay, getting back to the basics. So, Divine Holy Spirit, what do we have here for Aquarius? Somebody getting a sun. Somebody getting vitamin D from the sun. Stop being freakily. It's not that reader. Okay. <laughs> So, let's see. What do we have here for you, Aquarius, for the month of March 2022? Yep. Shoot for the stars, baby. 
like I said, following your bliss, navigating by stars, going through the night, um, still believing in yourself, but accelerate emotion, picking things up. You're moving at a fast pace. You're making communication. You're reaching out to people. I'm hearing, cause stars don't shine. They burn in constellation shift. But it was about the family. It was the family song at the end of Encanto. So, like I said, coming back in union with family, um, gatherings, could be getting ready to go to some sort of party or something like that. But, you know, you're you're becoming as one, you know, a whole going back around people that excite you, you know, that keeps you driven, that keeps you motivated for the month of March, right? The folks around you, they are rested, rejuvenated, and ready to go. Could be done with a Libra energy here. But um, there are also people around you that you have ended things with, okay, that you have thought about. Like, you know, I really don't want to entertain this anymore. You know, um, I don't want to keep uh, waiting on these people. I feel like it's the energy of the people, like, that either you were waiting on them or they're waiting on you, okay? Like, they're allowing you to take your time to come out your shell, you know, and I feel like you're here. You're you're bursting out and you're just, like, ready. Like, nope, wake up. It's time to do this. Let's do this. You also could be doing this, planning a party, pulling people together, trying to make something shake, okay? So... What happened here in the past was, yeah, you felt something in your gut. You you knew you had to get back to the basics. You knew something was missing again. I really feel the energy here of, like, people just really being shut down and locked up from, like, COVID. Like, Aquarius, it's heavy for you. And I feel like within that time, like, you thought of all these great ideas, how to come together with people, like, not seem so distant, so shut off or whatever. And, like, you're just being driven right now to, like, go and twerk with people, deal with people, affiliate, okay? Um... But I feel like these people around you, you know, they probably gave you your time, too, so that you can get yourself back together, get rejuvenated. And now is the time. Like, everybody's coming back together. Come together right now over me. Yep, spiritual strength. Okay, ancestors, everybody reuniting. But from the eight, you go to the nine, giving it one more go. Okay, knowing that you can do it. A lot of Encanto references. So this is definitely, like, heavy family energy. Okay, because I'm seeing Louisa like holding everything up. Okay, being supported. Um, so you're going to continue to be the support. You're going to be the greatest support right now for those around you. And I feel like that's because of everything that you know, everything that you have learned. Okay, everything that you understand. I feel like you're very, very wise. Okay, you've learned a lot. Okay, all this time being locked down, like I, it's like this feeling of not taking life for granted. Okay, like everybody's, it, it, it's it's crazy. I feel like you also have like this crazy energy. Like you got mad energy, mad motivation, crazy drive right now. Like it's off the chain. And I feel like this is all just from everything that you've learned in like a short amount of time here. Okay, like from speaking to people, understanding, like you're, you're becoming more understanding, more emotionally understanding of people around you. Okay, we got Sagittarius energy with that eight and that nine of wands here. Okay, travel. Okay, free thinking. Just getting out there, being carefree, living, right? So, yeah. Oh, balance underneath the deck. Libra energy. Okay. But, again, he has all the tools like the magician does. Making shit shake. You're making stuff happen. You're bringing balance to situations, to the family. Okay, to the job. This could even just be a job. But there's some, this is something that's close-knit. And you're coming up with the, the ideas and the plans to make something work. Like, I'm drawing, like, to nursing. So it's, like, best practice. Like, somebody who's creating policies and rules. Like, things that will help people. Like, that will be a benefit for everyone around you. Like, that's what you're doing. You're designing that type of stuff. It's part of your growth. You're growing. You're helping those around you grow. Yeah, with your honesty here. What, what it is that you know. With all that purple. What you know. What you honestly know. Okay? Yeah, this is bringing a lot of happiness. A lot of wish fulfillment. Okay? So, Divine Holy Spirit. Advice <laughs> for them. Grief. And it was... It was in reverse. No more grief. No more worry. No more stress. But it says, I understand that losing something is an opportunity to appreciate it. But there is no more of this. You're no longer in grief, okay? Like, I feel like things are opening up. You're seeing your friends, your family, okay? You're making these plans. Things are coming in, you know, the way that you need them to. You're being, you're back around your support groups, okay? Like, the spring is here. Everybody's waking up. The hibernation is done. It's over, right? Yes, discipline. You've been putting in a lot of work on yourself, understanding that you know i can do this like literally you can do this right so yeah and i can accomplish what i set my mind to so you're realizing you can do this and you feel good while you're doing that okay so final message here 
for our Aquarius. You, the results that you see of bringing people together is fulfilling you. Even if you're doing it by yourself, but you know that you're able to do it. Like you've had it so like built in so much within you, like built up. Okay, yes, today I am kind. It says, today I will make this day count. I will do something kind for someone. Like I said, you're putting it together. You done thought about it. Now it's time for you to shine. You're speaking up. You're delegating. You're doing it. Yeah, because today I am love. Like I said, you're building up love. You doing this is fulfillment to you. I feel like nine of cups. Today I will know in my heart that I deserve love and respect. And you are receiving that. It's being seen. Like you're waking the people up. They're seeing that as well. Like people were sleeping on you. They're seeing, you know the real you like you're putting kindness into the situation as that aquarius moonology card would say so yes that has been your message aquarius beautiful energy very uplifting i loved it i enjoyed it i hope you did i really hope this helped you guys until the next time we speak peace out